In South Africa, an entrepreneur is producing cheap hybrid motorized bicycles in the backyard of his township home. 33-year-old mechanically minded Kosana Madi is serving as a shining beacon of hope for his community in Kwatima Township, east of Johannesburg. CGTN's Julie Shire has more. Every great idea starts with a dream. And Inkosana Madi did just that. He combined his passion for motorcycles and practicality and developed a cheap motorized bicycle. It wasn't difficult, you know. I don't want to say there was no challenges, but it wasn't difficult because one, I'm a big bike enthusiast. You know, I used to be a full-time biker, I think for like four years. So anything that has to do with bikes, I want to know what's happening. So when I started this whole thing, yes, there are like challenges in terms of the tools that I'm supposed to use rather to make the bikes, the designing, because I didn't go to school for that. Maddie's dream is to produce these bicycles in bulk and help people from his community get to work. We're trying to make them as cheap and as accessible as possible, you know, because the other thing was the reason why I got, got to push them as much as I do is I live in Guatemala. Guatemala is a township to Springs. So Springs is an industrial and mining site, you know, so a lot of people that work there, don't, they don't earn much. So they use bicycles to go to and from work. So that's when the whole thing of actually trying to make them as cheap and as accessible as possible came from, you know. Yes, I can actually make them to whatever specifications that the clients want. You want them all Harley Davidson shaped and whatnot, we can do that. Obviously the more bells and whistles it comes with, the more it's gonna cost, you know. But right now we're standing at about $500. Inkosana started his bikes five years ago. And needless to say, he attracts attention whenever he takes a ride. The bikes I actually can make to client specification, right? It takes me, I would say, about a week to make from start to finish. And uh, you can pedal it, you know, like a normal bicycle, but it has a small 66cc motor. It's a two-stroke motor that you can kick in maybe like when there's an incline or you're feeling tired or you just want to look cool. You know, I mean, hey, who doesn't want to look cool? You can use the, 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 the that little motor and, uh, yeah, it's... It's quite efficient, actually, um, in petrol, because it's got a, a 1.8 liter tank. It can take you, that one tank can give you uh, about 80 k. Nkosana is also passionate about being a positive role model in his community. My biggest thing is I love to give back to my community, the community of Kwate. You know, I'd love to have other people, youth especially, you know, train them, like give them the skills that I have, you know, train them and teach them how to do what I'm doing. Who knows, maybe they can make even better things. Kosana, thank you so much. That was such a wonderful experience and it won't take long to see these inventions, these mopeds rolling down the streets of other communities. Julie Shara, CGTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.